So Judas left the disciples when he, he, he betrayed Jesus. And now what we have is in Acts 1, 21. We see the disciples when they are by themselves after Christ has ascended and they are now appointing a new disciple to replace uh, Judas and they appoint Matthias. Please, I so, want an evidence where Jesus Acts, said Acts Judas Iscariot is not one of my disciples because Jesus already told Judas Iscariot that he's going to betray him I mean, for example, and he knew that he was going to betray him. For example, Why didn't Jesus never say right? Judas, ask, oh yeah, I, let me ask you, Judas, by the way? let me I ask you, let me ask you, let me ask you, let me, let me hear it. did Jesus knew that Judas Iscariot was going to betray him? Yeah. Yes, he knows all if he knew that he was going to betray yeah. him, why didn't Jesus never say Judas Iscariot you're not among of my disciples, why? So because you like betrayed hour, him, why? Just like the hour, Christ can't just tell you when it's going to happen because if he does tell you, you might try to deviate from, 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 from the actual Christ, he doesn't know the hour. Christ knows the hour in the Quran and the Bible. No, yes. no, no. Yes. Christ said the Gospel of Mark, okay. chapter, the Gospel of Matthew, oh, oh, Ma oh, chapter Matthew. 12, verse 32. He said he doesn't know, no, he doesn't it's, it's, know it's the hour. It's 24, No, 32. it's 32. It's 24, 12. 36, man. Yeah, 24, 36. Yes, come on. Okay, Jesus doesn't know the hour. Okay. And but also, Mark, I think, or Luke, no chapter 13, 13 verse... Yeah. Chapter 13, verse what? Something. Verse 32. 32 remember, yeah, 32. Yeah. Jesus said he doesn't does know the no hour. What's, what's, what's no he doesn't know the hour. What does that mean? No, even the Son, yep. not the Holy Spirit. Yep. And guess what? what does that they mean? say the Holy Spirit had has only Wait, one divinity. It doesn't the Holy I mean, Spirit. one nature. Yes. It doesn't. Who said? It Jesus said, said what? He said, no one knows the hour. Not the Son, yes. not the angels in heaven, okay. and, and uh, it's not the Father. Okay, and the except Spirit the Father. Who is the Father? The Father is the first God the Father. Of the Trinity. Okay, is that the, the Holy Spirit? Calls. Okay, no, that, is the third person know the hour? Yes, they all do. Where? All three persons know Jesus the hour. said, not the Son. Okay. Not but the angels. Understand? He didn't the mention the Holy Spirit. The he said the Father knows the hour. But I'm not diverting the topic. No, 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 no. So come to the point. Come to the point. does not mean ignorance. The Jesus. word there means declaration. Oh. So we believe that the oh. three persons all have distinctive roles, right? The Father doesn't come down here as a man. Only God does. Only, only, oh, sorry, only, only the Son does, right? Who knows the, the hour? Way, they all know the Who hour. Who knows the hour? Only the Father can declare the hour. And so you believe... the word know there means declaration. Okay, no, no, you no, believe no, no, only God knows the hour? Only God knows the hour. Thank you. So Did the Je does knows. Jesus know the hour? He does know the hour. He said the Son does not no. know the hour. The Son knows the hour. Ah, uh, you forcing. Are you forcing? No, you didn't listen. Okay, who do you listen, him or Jesus? You tell me now. Yes. Who do you listen? Yeah, Jesus. Did Jesus say, I know the hour? No, no did he say? Did he say yes or no? In the book of Acts, did he uh, say yes or no? One, yeah, he said the gospel of Matthew, Matthew, Matthew chapter 24, verse 36. He said, well, no one knows the like hour, said, not the sun, not the because angels. Jesus does not know the hour. Forget about that. I'm not repeating. That one I'm not repeating. No, I'm not repeating. No. If I say I don't know the hour, who are you to tell me I know the hour? Can you force me? Not only the hour, so oh. many things. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. No, no, not only the hour. He was not all powerful, not all knowing. Several right, verses. You want to, you only, only let me give you several verses. You speak to him. We because I'm done with him always. I okay. just wanted to talk that topic yeah. about Judas Iscariot. Yeah. Christians, let me conclude. You, I can leave it with Go you. Ahead. I, I, I leave it with you. So here, Christians, they said Jesus is the way and the truth. Al -Hak. And Jesus Lord said Lord. Judas Iscariot is one of my disciples. Mm -hmm. They say Jesus is not one of the disciples of Jesus. No, Judas. Je Jude, I mean, Jesus said Judas Iscariot is not one of my disciples. Nope. Chris, Jesus said what? He's my disciple. So who will you, do we believe? Jesus or Christians? Definitely we believe Jesus' on. words. Yep. And he said my disciples will sit on the thrones and judge the Judas. 12 disciples, uh, the 12 <laughs> nations of Israelites. Yep. The Gospel of Luke chapter 22 verse uh -huh. 30. And again, Jesus counted his disciples, and one of them is Judas Iscariot, is not Mark, and is not Luke. In the Gospel of Luke, chapter 6, verse 13 to 16. So Christians, they stand for nothing. They said, why Judas, no, they said Judas Iscariot is not one of the disciples of Jesus. Why? Because he betrayed Jesus. And at the same time, he said, he said to me, Jesus died for the sins of Judas Iscariot. That's right. If Jesus died else. for the sins yeah, of Judas Iscariot, then that means Judas is sinless, nope. same as them. Otherwise, means. Jesus died for nothing. Nope. And they said Judas Romans did not five. repent. Right, you. If you say you have to repent yep. unless your sins are not forgiven, the then you repents. have double standard by nope. saying Jesus died for my sins. And at the same time, 
you need to repent. You do. So if in order your sins to be forgiven, yep. you have to repent. That Amen. means Jesus died for nothing. Nope. He died for you yes. to repent. The, where did Jesus say, in order I die for your sins, you have to repent? Uh, there's no that so condition. Th there's, there's Otherwise, John, anyways, John 3, 14, and Jesus. There's a Matthew 28, oh, 20, oh. Uh, sorry, 20, 28. Yeah, what does he say? Over there. Where does he say, in order your sins to be forgiven, you have to repent? So that means Jesus I died mean, for Jesus nothing. Christ, so he, John said what? This is the Lamb of God who repents. will take the sins on, away of the world, the yes. sins of the world. Yes. So Judas Iscariot. A follower of Jesus, yep. a believer of Jesus. Yep. He just sinned. Yep. You cannot remove him from Christianity. Well, you sin you as can, well. Otherwise, you are not a Christian. Do the things if of sinning makes you out dies, of, takes you out of Christianity, says, then, then you're not a Christian. Simple. You're not a follower of Christ. If you Christ. die, in, uh, you're not a Christian. Uh, in, in so, Islam, for example, if you die a mushrik, then you're going to hell. Look, simple. The Gospel of Luke, Same chapter thing. six, verse thirteen to sixteen. Jesus counters his, his, his disciples. L Judas Scarlet is one of them. Luke and Wait, Mark are not one again? of them. Okay. I'm not repeating. You are. So now, again, Jesus also died for nothing. Do you know what Jesus well, said? No, he didn't. The Gospel of Matthew, chapter Without 6, verse dying, 14. We have no hope. He said, in order your sins to be forgiven, you have to forgive the sins of others. How do you know he said that? Your father will forgive. Jesus said that. The how Gospel you know, of Matthew, you know well, chapter yeah. 6. It, 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 what, it, it, no, Tell him. Listen. No, he doesn't believe your book. I'll ignore him. He doesn't believe your book. I'll ignore him. I know him. I know him. It does say that you cannot hate God. So you can't hate, hate your brother and say you love God. And then when we pray the Lord's Prayer, we ask the Lord to forgive us our sins as we forgive those who help us against us. So it's important uh, that if we want to be forgiven, we have to do the same thing as well. So, yes, let right. me come to the forgiveness. The Go forgiveness, ahead. the crucifixion itself is yep. an evil act. Well, and mean, we it's know, not nice. I can give you a verse. Now I'm using the Bible. Nice now sure. I'm giving you the verse. It's not nice though. Like, Ju Jesus prayed God to, to, the, to the Father and asked God to forgive the sins of Jews, the people who crucified him. What did he say? Well, the gospel of my, the gospel of, wait, too. let me finish. Even too. Romans, both of them. Yeah. He said, oh Father, the gospel of Luke chapter 20 and 23, Verse 34, you know what Jesus said? Oh, Father, forgive them. They do not know what they are doing. Yes. So that means, why did he say that? Because of crucifying him. So if the crucifixion is a holy incident, why would Jesus Wait. ask God to forgive who, who the sins? Who said it was a holy incident? Yeah, where you got that from? Uh, yeah. that was a holy incident? Are you saying the crucifixion is an evil act? Well, yes, it is. It's not nice. Uh, it's not nice. No. And you believe that causes salvation. So evil well, yes. act, an evil act, yeah. and a salvation. Yeah. Salvation yeah. and an evil act can what, they match. So the Bible says salvation. What, what man intended salvation. evil, God turned around for good. Salvation. Yeah. Okay, again, if Jesus knew he came to die for G uh, Christians, yeah. Yeah. why would Jesus well, no, hide for himself? World. Why would Jesus hide himself from the crucifixion? The Gospel of Mark, well, chapter 8, verse 30. Go read. Well, Jesus said to his disciples, no. Do not disclose about me to anyone. About what? The crucifixion. And guess what? Wait, Who wait, planned wait. the crucifixion? Hold this out, Satan. Hold Satan. This out, Satan bring entered verse, Judas. Bring the verse, what verse do you want? The one you just said. Which bring one? The about um, you, about the, uh, Christ told his disciples not to disclose where yeah. he was. Bring it up. Mark chapter 8, verse 30. 30. Chapter 8? The, the crucifixion is like, like 19. What are you talking about? What? 8, chapter, 8, chapter 8, 8, 8, 8, 8, 8. It hasn't even happened yet. Wait, I'll show you. Wait. Mark, what are you talking about? Wait, it's coming here. Oh my goodness. So, it's it's coming here. You don't need You're to rush. Conflating two occurrences. Mark chapter 8 is okay. here, it verse 30. Jesus warned them not to tell anyone about him. You said Okay, wait, 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 wait. I'm coming. Was Jesus not hiding in the garden? No. Before the crucifixion. He was praying there. He was praying. Why? Okay, wait. Why was he praying? Pause. Okay. If he, Pause, came, to, if he came to die. Don't forget that we already know that Christ was aware that Judas would betray him. He said okay. this multiple times, okay. even in uh, uh, the, the final uh, like uh, Last Supper, right? Yeah. So, because he knew he yes. wasn't hiding anywhere, yes. because he knew wherever he went to, yeah. uh, Judas would tell the Pharisees where he was. So he was not hiding. He was not hiding. No. Okay, You're logically, praying. you tell me now. I was sent by God, and I know myself, I came to die for Christians, or all the world, the whole world, mankind. Why would I need, logically it doesn't make sense, why would I need to, to pray to God and to ask him to save me? 
If I came to die for because your sins, logic nonsense. No, I'm not one. talking about my God. Why have you forsaken me? He said, God. Oh, which one, sorry? He said, God, yep. save me from the death. Okay, sure. Did he not say no. that? Okay, if Jesus, if Jesus knew God, that he came to die man. for your sins, so he that. logically, it doesn't make sense. No. My he God, down, save me, forget. save me. He was fully man and fully so God. did he forget so that he came he to fully, die? When he was fully man, okay. Of course, he was aware that what was befalling him I got another question. was going to be horrible. I got another so question for you. Not you answer? only would he get crucified for not doing anything, but also he had to bear the sins of the world on him as well. So any man knowing this stuff would be afraid. Okay. But, Wait, but, but why would he be afraid? The important the important part, the important part is... The angels came no, 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 to no, no. straighten him. Stop, you. stop. Don't forget, the important part here uh -huh. is that even though he was afraid, yes. even though he doesn't want to die in the flesh, he still submitted himself to God. He and, came to and, die, and, but he and, was and afraid, yes. and he was crying to Absolutely. God. Absolutely. But he was never not going to do it. So that means Jesus so never as knew... as Christians, we can be afraid, okay. but as long as Let we me ask you. to God, then we're fine. Let me ask you. If Jesus Do came, well, I've got answer. another question. 